Let's deal with this limit, the limit with x approaching to negative 4, 1 over 4 plus 1 over x, over 4 plus x. As usual, what we need to do is plug in negative 4 into all the x and to see what we get. And let me just do this um, you know, without showing much work. Plug in negative 4 right here, you will get 1 fourth minus 1 fourth. So you have 0 on the top. On the negative 4 into x, we get 4 minus 4. We also have a 0 on the bottom. So it's a 0 over 0, we have to do more work for this. This right here is a complex fraction because we have two small fractions on the top and then a big fraction, right? And to take care of this situation, we are going to multiply the top and bottom by the lowest common denominator of the small fractions. So in this case, the lowest common denominator of the small fraction, it will be 4 and x, which is going to be 4x. And I'm just going to multiply the top by 4x and the bottom by 4x as well. So this is going to give me, so let me still write down the limit when x approaches to negative 4. And on the top, multiply 4x with 1 over 4. And as you can see, the 4 and then the 4 right here cancel each other out. I will just have an x. And take 4x, multiply with 1 over x. The x cancel out. So I will just get plus 4. On the top, I have plus 4. And we only multiply out the top because the top is where the complex fraction is, right? The small fractions. On the denominator, I didn't need to fix it. So let me just keep it as how it is. Let me just keep this as uh, how it is. But I will write 4x in the front. And then we will have 4 plus x in the parentheses. 4 plus x. And you need to notice that here we have x plus 4. And here we have 4 plus x. They are exactly the same. I can cancel these two out, right? So in another word, this is going to be the limit when x approaches to negative 4. On the top, I have 1. On the bottom, I have 4x. Now I just need to plug in negative 4 into this x, and I will get 1 over 4 times the negative 4 into x. Altogether, I will get negative 1 over 16, and that will be the answer.